Good morning, everybody. We're doing Paranormal Entities today, which is an itch.io game. And we'll just play it, see what's going on. There's lots of ways to make noises and terrify me, so feel free to do so. Okay. You are Cliff, a college student who is a brand new freelance cameraman for the show Paranormal Entities, the number two rated ghost investigation show on the hunting and outdoor cable network. Good job, Lee. You have been hired to inspect the St. Augustine Asylum for the Mentally Ill. You will go to this facility, follow the producer's instructions through the earpiece, keep your camera on, try to make contact with the spirits inside. If nothing happens, you will get $500 for your time. Or if something, oh, if you manage to get some amazing footage of real paranormal activity on your camera. Then, then what? Like, there's a little thing here. If you manage to get, I'm assuming it's meant to say you get, you know, a Coke or something. All right, Clint, uh, Cliff, uh, Cliff, Cliff, welcome to the that is my name, apparently. Asylum for the Mentally Ill. My producer Tom said good things about you. In your backpack, hmm. and a flashlight, and a voice recorder, and EMS. Hey, how you doing? A couple of little fun What's happening today? I mean, if the sounds wrong or anything. Ready to pay off some of those college debts and beer tabs? Well, and when you're ready, enter in through those front doors. I know he told me something. I know he said something. I had to do something. I know it. How are we going today? You're about to sleep. Oh, so like 10 a.m. here today for me. So not sleep time yet. No, I know. He's gonna sit there and listen to my voice. Hey, Mello, how are you doing today? What's been happening with you? I haven't, I haven't spoken to you in a while. Mm. I don't remember. I didn't hear what he said I needed to do. Nice. The door was unlocked. Ah, it can get a little sticky sometimes. So here's the story. Why did it close behind me? It was founded in the 1880s, closed in the 19th. Uh, work stuff. Uh, <laughs> Unless the end stuff is good. <clears throat> Excuse me. It was around 3,300 patients a year. I mean, the place was uh -huh. you know, less of a hospital and more of a place where you dropped your problems off and hope they disappeared. Yeah, I've been doing bits and pieces, but it's school holidays here, so, you know, a lot more distractions around. <coughs> Never gonna cough. With non threatening mental conditions or those deemed inappropriate, society together with legitimate psychopaths and murderers and other violent monsters and basically said, Let God sort it out. You wait for a second. Season here are just taking too much to count. The death toll was unreal. The violence was just crazy. Nobody cared. And once you came to this place, yeah, it's just sitting life. right here. Hmm. Which way should we go, left or right? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. What a nice drawing. You know? This is where the hundred hallway patients would convene, and we heard that the patients pre-1920 actually received decent care. Then the war hit, the depression hit, and then the budget all fell apart. The room you stand in once healed 20 patients in need of um, By the end, that sucks. 150 patients would pass through this room. So what are you doing again? Being attacking each other at random, playing themselves with metal wires from their bed. And be careful where you step. Alright, this is a good place to start. I want you to take Little a hour. voice recorder and I'll hopefully yeah, okay. to awaken this place. Okay. So I've never worked in a restaurant. I worked for events, but not the same thing. So I never did like Show us cooking or... I did waitressing a bit, but Feel only like... Interact with anything or 
<coughs> I'm so sorry. One day. <coughs> I don't even know what happened to you. I didn't even have a smoke or anything. Okay, play that back. Just know that you're here. I'm taking my medications this morning. Uh, nothing. All right, let's try this. So you're working nights or? Ooh. Slightly different spot to the max. Yeah, okay. I mean, it might be interesting. Is it really fast paced and whatnot? I imagine you'd be constantly doing something. I give you permission to come to life. Just give us a sign that you're here. Tell us where you are. Speak to us now. Draw me a map. Let me know exactly where you are. Make sure you check out the blurbs and stuff like that because you can. Um, yeah, there you go. It's telling you it right now. You can play scary me like you can play random things when it gets scary. Make me jump out of my face. Oh, a slightly different spot. Oh, what's all this newspaper article? Or some shit. Ghosts of Saint Augustine, you're all a bunch of ghoulish pricks. Show <laughs> up or piss off. Oh, oh God. Did you say that? It just jumped out at me. <laughs> Don't cry, go see why she's. All right, all right. We, looks like we got an investigation. All right, I want you to go down the morgue hallway, and we're going to continue our investigation in the other gathering area. Mm. Get the crap out of me. Is it close to where you live or is it like quite a commute? Oh shit. I'm playing it on the screen but as I move it around like the mouse goes over there so then I click there and then it's meh. Okay. Don't freak out. Don't freak out Kenzie. You're okay. area is the first on the list. This is the area where the inmates who are deemed a danger to society would convene. You'll go to this room and perform a summoning ceremony. So walk into the center... That's the dumbest idea I've ever heard in my life. Let's go in a haunted place and do a summoning ceremony. Do these people not watch movies? Oh yeah, this is a good place to get murdered. Patient room, isolation room. This is the entrance to patient cell 200 through 219. We're talking extreme bipolarism, schizophrenia, dementia. Not necessarily. To my house. Yeah, great. Thanks. It could be a challenge for society. Dang, the doors. Yeah, babes. No problem. Thank you. You're a star. Beautiful imagery. Where exactly would you like me to summon ghosts so I can die a slow and painful death? Entrance to the patient cells 220 to 240. This is where they kept the lunatics, mm -hmm. murderers, and sociopaths. The worst of the worst, including Clive the Peeper Johnson. You'd think he would be a pervert with a nickname the Peeper. Yeah, he would, but he steals eyes, doesn't he? He was extremely manipulative and very oh. intelligent. He was a murderer and a maimer. Most of his victims could never identify him because he managed to convince them gouge their own eyes out with oh, God. Wires, and even their own fingernails. He came here due to legal loopholes, and when the facility went off the rails and the doctor stopped caring, he jumped into action. The patients who didn't listen were tortured, and the ones who did wandered around the facility, blind, screaming, and in constant fear. Jesus. Too. Hmm. Let's just start the ceremony. I wish you'd stop telling me about all these murders and stuff like that. It's like, yeah, these are the ghosts you probably get to, so they're really bad. And let's just do it anyway. No, you come in here and do it. You move your butt. Come over here and you summon them. This is the shittest job I've ever had in my life. Oh, God. Oh, 
No, don't release him from restraints. Oh god. Oh god. Holy crap. Oh. No. Oh god. Go check it out. Go check what out? I don't want to check it out. You check it out. Isn't this the way I just came? No. No. This isn't the way I came. This is where scary people live. Where's my mouse again? Fuck, it's over here. It's so annoying. You've got to play just in display and then when you're moving, because I've also got the gamer mouse. So it just... I have to do the, I'll have to grab my other mouse actually after this one maybe. Oh god. Hello. I brought you KFC chips. Would you like some? Hello? No? Okay. No chips for you. I can get you a happy meal if that's more your taste. No. Oh, I don't wanna. I didn't even see anything there, it was literally just the noise. Oh god. God, that room is tiny. Imagine being stuck in there with no windows, apart from this little thing here. If you weren't mental beforehand, you'd be mental after, wouldn't you? Jesus. No, 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 Okay. Oh god, the chair moved around. I missed it. I was too busy shitting myself. All is okay. All is okay. Looks like. Oh. oh, very cute. I feel protected. Oh, God. I'm here with your dominoes. Fuck it, we got death wish, let's go. Hello, go see. No eyes get out, run death. Cut cut him out. Yeah, fair enough. Is that so? Pea butter. Thought maybe she was asking for pepper. Okay. Um Oh god, that's terrifying. I can't run. Okay, so you can't run. It's good to know. Will you stop screaming? I'm just trying to find my way back. Alright, get out of this hallway and then take a take your second right. Um Ah, hang on. One, two, so that's the second right, wouldn't it be? No, okay, not the second right. I can't follow instructions. It is. Look, you get out of the hallway and then you took your second right. Fuck it. Fuck it. Let's try all the doors. I got myself confused now. Doors locked. Damn it, damn it. Oh, okay. There's a there's a staircase. Take the staircase up to the second floor. That's and what happens. You should be next to a fire escape, you should be able to get out that way. So so go up the staircase. Don't go into haunted places and do fucking summoning rituals. And I should bring KFC with you. Number one, they've got salt. <laughs> oh, great, now I'm stuck. Crap. Uh, okay, we need to, let's go get some of the 
pry this door open. Go back downstairs. I, I bet you there was stuff downstairs we could probably use. How far downstairs do you want me to go? All the way? Hold on, hold on. That staircase wasn't there before. Nope. This place doesn't even have a basement. The, what, what is Come in isolation, on? gas chamber, silent right. room, and incinerator. I don't think you got any other hey! Not too bad. We're having a... <sighs> Try not to be terrified. How you doing today? Oh my god. Oh, don't you start talking to me. I don't know where this thing is. I'm gonna eat my face. Steal my eyeballs. We see you. We see. Oh, good. Good. That's very, very good. At least I know I'm not alone, I suppose. And again, I kind of want to be. Oh no, that's the worst. Oh, I hate that. Surgery. That is the worst when you have to replay it and things because things have been deleted. Oh, good. Some more summoning. So, are you doing that on stream today or are you just. Um, are you going to be doing it and then coming back, streaming? Oh, I don't want to, I don't want to do this. Um. Mm. by on. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, why would we want to open that door with... Looks like a bloody uvula. <laughs> uvula. Why did I decide that word? Oh, that is good. Oh, that is good. I hate it when you sit there and you're playing, and you're playing, and you're playing, and um, like just whatever game it is, and you've been playing for hours, and then it crashes or something, and then you realise the last time you saved was a hundred years ago. Oh, beautiful! That sounds awesome. I love watching people play Ark. Like I love playing it, but I love watching people play it too. And yes, I am seeing to myself as a comfort. <laughs> mm. Like seriously, fire hazard, paper, candles. Should really get a safety inspector in here. Anything to... Mm. Okay. We're at a dead end. Ha uh ha. -huh. It's funny because the place is haunted and we're gonna die. <laughs> yeah, yeah, good, good, good. Pretty enjoyable all all in all. Oh my gosh. Sorry, I am paying attention. I also don't want to, like, die. <laughs> I don't even know if I can die. Because it's just, um, like, it's an indie game. So chances are I probably won't be able to die. But I get into them, you know, and then I'm, like, thinking about my character. And... Oh god, what was that? Oh, it's just a... Okay, a <laughs> shadow glitch. Oh my god, that scared me. And when, once you start getting jumpy, then all on for young and old, isn't it? Oh, maybe they're trying to romance us. I mean, look, all these candles and stuff, maybe they're just trying to, you know. They've probably been down here for a very long time. They might be lonely. Can't light them or anything, though. Like. The huge in the room. The... What the heck? Like, I'm sure I've tried every bloody door. Yeah. Did 
don't have to change my mouse over. So I've got this one, which is a, you know, OH, OHNS RSI one. Whoop, whoop -a doop. Where is it plugged in? Oh, now I'm playing a dangerous game, even more dangerous than that one. Am I going to unplug the wrong bloody thing? Have you played much Primal? How many hours into it? There we go. Let's go here for now. Oh, sorry. I'm just babbling crap. Um, so I just changed my mouse over because my hand was starting to cramp up. So, what are your plans for today? It just seems to sound different than the other ones. Yeah, yeah. So that's your plan for the whole day, just doing that? I think I've got doing this and then doing some editing. Well, apparently I'm just going to be stuck in here forever. And then I'm um, having a picnic. Picnic. Hmm. Yeah, okay. So a couple of hours of that, and then I'll be Betty Bice time. Did you have a good day today? Like, seriously, I'm just walking around like, trying to open the same doors. We'll go down this one. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, I'm glad to hear it. What was the best thing that made you smile today? Oh, my heart is pounding like a million beats a minute. Oh, a tit almost jumped out of my shirt just because of my heart. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. We're okay. Everything's okay. Mm -hmm. <sighs> oh, padded. No, it's not padded. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Thank you for letting me know. I will fix that up. I don't like this pen. This pen's holding me back. Just call it. Alright, I will fix that up. And after, after I finish this, I'll put it in the comments as well. It's just if I close this down, because it's just in a screen, you'll see everything else that's behind it, and no one needs to see all that crap. Actually, it's probably just Discord. <laughs> oh, so, uh, so, uh, we're trapped. <gasps> mm. 
Oh, no eyes. No eyes, don't see. Don't see. Is my mouse gone? Oh, God. Keeps giving me a hand and then taking it away again. Safe. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God, I didn't even notice that fucker. Hello. Ah. It's alright, you didn't scare me. I knew you were there. Hmm. Why would you put a hot pile of pictures of eyes down a hall which had a serial killer that likes to steal people's eyes? Isn't that like putting porn around a sex addict's room? It's ridiculous. Oh, look, that's pretty. I don't want to go in there. I will go out this window, thank you. These are things you tell me beforehand. I'll shut these eyes. Holy crap. Okay, so that's all changed now. That's where we came. Nope, 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 nope. Can't use that I'm noping out. <laughs> okay, okay. <sighs> Do you have a flashlight, sir? No, you do not have a flashlight? Okay, thank you for... Thank you for listening. Yo, 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 yo. Oh no, now I'm locked in again. Uh, um, and hide where? I can't run. There's not an option to run. Well, at least I can. Oh, Jesus. Uh. Um. Um, oh shit. Okay, I can't run. There's not an option to run. 
I'll just saunter vaguely. Oh, my. Oh, take a breath. Shit. I reckon it's a box of chocolates because he's very upset that he's been worrying me. I don't think it's a... Oh shit. Um ah! Holy crap, man. I can't believe The workers comp on this is gonna be out of this world. Freaking gouged your eyes out with a scalpel. Are you alright? I know you're not, huh? Holy crap. Just peachy. Alright, alright, we're, we're we're getting a picture from your camera. <laughs> so, let's just move the camera around. We can't see anything. There, there's no light. In the room, there's nothing I can see. The flashlight went out, and, and we, we don't even know where you are. Hmm. I'm not going in there. I, I, do you, are you going in there? I'm not going in there. I'm, hell no. Look. Uh, that guy's a, the worst boss. I'm, if you can't feel anything, I, I'm sorry. We're not coming. I'm sorry, man. I have to go. I'm sorry. He's gonna leave me here. Holy crap. Exactly. Teary eyes crying. Dude, that was intense and awesome. Wow. I'm going to need a few seconds just to deal with that, so I'm just going to take a quick break and I'll set up the next game. Um, so just bear with me for just a few minutes. That was insane. Let me know what you thought of that game as well, if you're watching, um, if, you wish, if you wish to. I will be doing, putting it into a YouTube video, so any kind of comments and stuff like that that you guys have, I will put in there. Yeah. So that was Paranormal Entities. That was amazing. I don't even know what to say about it. Um, the voice acting was great. The graphics were great. The storyline was great. I'm sick of saying the word great, but honestly, it was it blew my mind. Um, as you can see with this footage, this is one that I did on stream directly but you can just see my face I was going to do another one I still might but it won't be as honest reactions as this one is I don't think put in the comments um if you like the game if you didn't if you like the video if you didn't um and if there's anything else that you can think of that I should play in indie games I'd love to hear about them remember to like and subscribe and I will see you on the next one hey scared kitties Mwah.